And welcome to the Rowe College Basketball Invitational along the beautiful sands, sunny beaches of Daytona Beach. So glad you could join us tonight for the first of two games and the first meeting all time between Arkansas State and High Point, the four versus the one seed here at the CBI. Tip it up against Jocelyn Bodo Bodo. And High Point. Keza Jippa has it first. Underway at semifinal number one in the CBI Championship. So glad you could join us tonight. All the tournaments taking place, a fun time of year, an important time for these teams to have a chance to win a title. Jeffa inside, they'll work it inside out, and the open three is short. Theum off the mark, the rebound caroms out to Hamilton. A lot of threes in this game, there'll be a lot of long rebounds. Is it as simple as whichever team can make the most threes will be the team that wins the game? Pretty much. Now Rocket Science, it's basketball. Jeff with the pump bait. Short, the putback is there for Bodo Bodo. No, Bodo Bodo with a rebound. I think you're gonna see a heavy dose of Hicks and isolation once Arkansas State gets the switch they want. Runner for Jeffa high off the glass is good. For high point. Smash mouth basketball. Smash you know. mouth hoops. Floater is there. Down to shot put 10 footer. I feel like we see more of that. Yes. Collegiate level lately from 10 feet in as you indicated. Just a little push shot that gets up there from the bigs. Come off the bench in time, he eats. He's in Bradwell. Yeah, this is a correctable error because they deemed that it was not a shooting foul. So they've actually taken a point off the board, if you will. I've never seen. Point advantage for High Point. First of two semifinals at the CBI, and that shot. A young freshman with rim protection. He plays so deep anyway. A lot of times he's in a one-man zone. And one of Arkansas State's game plan points today is to occupy him in that low block area. Johnny Hamilton also stuck in there. It's been a dual rejection. Dish inside and Nelson in a good look. Line cut, that Kansas cut. It is so hard to defend. BM left wide open, banks it in. Well, you got a big sell. Nelson left wide open. That's by design. He'll make him pay for three. Just Iders still dancing. A tremendous season. It's been eight years with Coach Oates at Buffalo and also in T Town. High Point has it out of the timeout. And Jeff up. Inside. Wait, he will find the lob to Nelson, I promise you. Nelson on cue with the runner. I like his three ball as well that we <laughs> saw moments ago, and it's a good start for Isaiah. In fact, he's got nine points for Arkansas State. He has scored every point for the Red Wolves. And a putback finally up and in by Hamilton. Another level from a above the rim perspective. Like he's on a pogo stick yes. above everybody else. Yes. You can buy that. Hamilton, the lob, Bodo Bodo collects and finishes. Yeah, that really wasn't there. The rejections can jump out of the gym. Jeff with a bounce pass. How about dropping that time to Zuba? Nice job of over and over. Give Nelson ball fakes. Screen for four. Todd in the right place at the right time. Otherwise, that's a turnover. Pass was headed to you. Two. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Isaiah Nelson was three ready. Not even halfway through our first half. Zuba's got four coming off the bench. He averages a point a game. Right now, Jeffa is taking the ball wherever he wants it offensively. That points lead at seven. Fields left wide open. That's a three. He's a capable three-point shooter, not a great. A fun pace already, oh, but love it. two of the more efficient offensive teams in the land. Miles connects. 
Yeah, if this is your first time to see High Point. In Checks out. Oh, he's going to let another one fly. Didn't even look at the rim. Pick and pop. That's why. Nelson at double figures. He's got 14 points. Gunas on the floor. High point turns it over. Watch the ball screen, and the, now they did drop coverage. Todd makes a pay. That's a good read by Todd. He's reading the situation. It was Zuba. And when he didn't come at him at that hard hedge double team, he takes advantage. Nelson has done it all in this first half. A rejection on defense, a clear path for Hicks. And Arkansas State grabs a lead for the first time. Pops out to four. So High Point jumped out to that eight point lead and now Arkansas State with the advantage. 35 and wide, a big reason why. What else has changed in this game? Well, again, there's the double team. And once you beat the double team, you ought to be able to score. Taryn Todd heard you loud and clear. Arkansas State. I can't, I can't go away from the chalk on either side. Yeah, UConn, you wonder if they're going to have a chance to go back to back. Kelvin Sampson in Houston may have something to say about it. Open three, Todd, no. And Bodo Bodo the rebound. That's a good job by Bodo Bodo keeping Nelson off the glass. Miles, brilliant pump fake. And on the other end, 21 in purple. Now with. How smooth was that with the roll? Averaging off this season. That's a quick trigger. And it's all net from team Terran Todd. What the job that Ford did on Miles, though. And the three drops for Trey Benham, his first bucket. 33 from deep. Hicks initiated contact. Benham clears. Benham again will try the other side. And save, but it's right to Jeppo. And free throws coming. A whirling dervish inside. Right across the road, Daytona, Baylor, and SC Duke in Yukon. Upset by Paige Beckers. Get back to their winning ways in the postseason. High point back in the zone. It's yeah, they're, effective at times. Their gap integrity is so good. In layman's terms, gap integrity in basketball, what does that imply? That means that you're in the gap to assist defensively. Three ball, top of the key for Fields. You try to drive in that zone with the width between the players. So your left foot, if you're on the right side of the floor, is always in the gap position. So in terms of what they're able to do, scoring, a lot of teams better at any level. Oh. How about the bounce? A very soft rim for Freddie Hicks. You would never get that into... Picked up by four, the double pump fake. Rolls it in off the glass. So confident in his go off the window. Jiffin double figures, he's got 11. That's another three from the wing. Oh, off the glass for Terran Todd. How did he bank it from that angle? It's the second one tonight, we've seen one for each side. Todd, playing very well. Allen Huss this season. Points, four rebounds, five assists. Out on the perimeter, that means Bodo Bodo's on the perimeter. So who rebounds for high point? Bodo Bodo with the screen for Hamilton. But the crossover was sick. Little hesitation and the floater drifting backwards, no problem. Nothing wrong with the defense that time by Hicks. The Hamilton offense was just better. Good offense beats good. Hamilton with 10. High point by two. 
and the pump fake for Hicks results in contact. Two free throws on the year. One more coming. Well, you're the former coach, not me. I think the high point offensive chart shooting 52%. Tied at 38. Hamilton draws the double team, lost the handle, and was fouled. Hicks flipped him, had something to say. Shooting team, almost 78%. They haven't gotten as many calls. Haven't been to the line quite as much their last three games, a combined third. Jiffa on cue, banks it in. He was in the air forever, and I'll let you know about it afterwards. Again, he's going to his strong side. Arkansas State has not shaded him enough. An open three for Hicks, he'll pass it up. And shoot two. And everybody on that. Now coming up tomorrow, star set it in. In the West, battling the Suns, Katie Devin Booker. Covered tips with it. Nobody talks about the Nuggets. Yeah. Cole Jokic, very fine with that. And that uh, very talented, sharp shooting roster, defending world champions. And they are right there, just like Jeff has been right there tonight. Too easy, and high point went two for one. I love it. So, Panthers lead it by five. Hicks open at the top of the key. Boy, he should have gotten it back. He couldn't carry on the rebound. And the lob, no! Well, Bodo Bodo somehow came away with it. What an effort play. That was wild. Shot clock is off. Keza Chippa. From 16, drops it in with a mid-range. Keza Jippa with 17 points in the first half. He'll close it out with the elbow J. We talk. It's Jiffa going back to the continued debate online, whether it's a GIF or a GIF. He pronounces his last name Jiffa. I just wanted to be crystal clear on that. Goaltending the call on a bucket for Taryn Todd as we start our second half. Yeah, I thought that was a good. Now here's a different defense because right now Ford is in complete denial mode on Jiffa. Hamilton, the sweeping runner. Dangerous game to play because High Point is so diverse offensively. Diversity on the other end, Freddie Hicks. Ways and Hicks tonight now in double figures. Now watch when Jiffa gives the ball up. Watch three white, Ford. Watch him try to deny. Ford got away with two fouls, a couple of bumps to the face. Jiffa, no problem. Oh my goodness. An efficient seven, make it eight for 11 start for Keza Jippa. Hicks on the other end. Out hard. Benham picks up the, from my angle, I thought oh, there was. Only the first of being, or a whistle being called. Uh, that's where you get in trouble, in my opinion. And off Nelson, the push shot is there again. Third time we've seen that from 35. It's automatic. You can see Ford trying to play Jeff up more towards his right, 35 feet from the bucket. Diem, Bodo Bodo, back on the pogo stick. Again, you don't all. The spin, Diem. Nate Diem has yet to really seize control in this game. Field somehow got it to go, and Bodo Bodo still in the air. Trying to swat it away. And double technicals just called, one on each side. Anthony E. 3 3, going to the seventh game. That's the yeah. vibe I get. Yes, I, I, that's valid. It's all those games of the high scoring variety. Miles oh. throws it up and in for the one handed delivery for the Troy transfer. Oh, the trio of Panthers. High point comes away with it. Great job by Miles of being the quickest to the ball. Up and in again, back-to-back -back buckets for 23 in purple. Outside to Jippa. Jippa knew that shot was off the mark as soon as he released it. Chase down the board, could do it. Oh. Nelson with a flush. Trailing big man. 56-51. That points lead has been as arch as eight tonight. 
Hawks in the first half. Miles bumped on the three by Todd. And that's a no-no, Duke. Baskets here in the last two minutes. For Miles will get one. Todd stays on the floor with the three fouls. So a big ball. Todd weaving his way through traffic. Tough shot. Pops out to Fields. New life for Hicks. Bodo Bodo is a one-man wrecking crew in the paint. Short by Todd from downtown. Jippa has it. High point. Numbers if it hurries. Benham for three. Rolls it in, and High Point officially with its largest lead. And Jippa contact, and that dribble went right off of his foot into the hands of Ford. Arkansas State turns it right back over. A hectic pace. Tell the Red Wolves are trying to pick up that defensive intensity. Duke Miles open, makes some pay from downtown. Push the ball, but good things usually happen when you find the second side of the floor. Todd got it to go, an awkward delivery, but it counts. Number six in white with three personal fouls. Change of defense here, a little one, two, one, one, or what coaches refer to as a diamond in one. The lob and the flush, and don't look now, but Bodo, Bo the Stags. And Seattle U, Red Hawks. All right, so for Arkansas State, you mentioned it earlier, trying to get the fight back to the middle of the ring. Yeah. More plays like that, I assume? Yeah, I think him above that area. Boto Boto, the seven-footer from Cameroon. Learn how to learn and use that. <laughs> That's the Let's see if Arkansas State scores and stays in the press. Fields, lobs it up, Nelson grabbed it at its apex, will get it back again this time, missed the dunk, third time, no, Bodo Bodo slammed him against the glass and find Bodo Bodo in that position. Now, score the first nine points of the game, for, he's taking a lot of shots to the face tonight, yeah, and he's probably thinking to himself, really, to his credit, did not complain. After the non calls, tied the fadeaway. Ideally, you want to attack. That's what I think. Well, he's been so good in the mid range here in the second half. Shots and a three. 14 points on the board for the leading score for the Panthers. Now I think you should attack. No bo bo Bodo Bodo. Lob to Nelson. Brilliant execution, Hicks with the... Todd, the jump stop and the finish under control. Well, they rolled the dice, came away clean. Here's Hicks. Nelson, Hicks with a tip in. The press is back on. It's been a game changer for Arkansas State. High point just one for its last seven from the floor in Miles. Last two and a half minutes, that'll change. Another one of the quarters to make it to the semis. Here's Hicks going downhill. Bodo Bodo, goaltending, they'll count it. Second infraction on Bodo Bodo in the goaltending department. Fuck. Bodo Bodo again, rim protecting. Does the ball get at the height of its shot? And I think it does. That was press breaks where nobody dribbles. Keep the ball off the deck. The ball moves quicker in the air than it does when you're beating it to death on the wood. Panthers won for their last eight from the floor. Miles stepped up his play in the second half. Two pump fakes. One-hander, no. Bodo Bodo and a fresh 20. And a foul called inside. Bodo Bodo will. And the front end of the one and one. Bodo. 11 points and 13. Last lead for Arkansas State back when it was 36 35. And Bodo Bodo with a personal foul. 16 points. Into of efficiency this year with that tempo. Top mid. You mentioned Crafty. Duke Miles has been. All that and a lot more. 
Bottled up baseline delivery. Bodo Bodo. Up and in. What a play by the fresh guards with the blocks. Now at five tonight. And Todd with a push. Jiffa hit. High Point has four players on their roster who have shot. Alan yes, Hunt. absolutely. Score at the arc, score at the rim, or get fouled. Jeff, Jeff is still in pain, coach. He was grasping at his lower back. You won. And he was correct. That's a lot of basketball. That's a lot of basketball. Reba clean look, but he had a shot. Off the foot of Fields, right to Hamilton. Great look inside, and Bodo Bodo was hacked hard. The sixth block for Bodo Bodo, and now in addition to that, they want to go back and check that last infraction to see if it warrants consideration for upgrading to a flagrant one as Bodo Bodo was hammered by Hicks. Counts for a lot, even though statistics. Who have so much trouble shooting free throws, a lot of times it's because of hand side in their hand. As a result, the trajectory is never the same. Baseline for Todd, and a clean scoop. But smart, know your worth to your team. Todd at 21. Voto Voto knows his worth. Guessing High Point will have to oh. that out in the offseason, too. Nelson, the steal, and coast to coast. Here comes a gift. Miles just fumbled the ball away. Nelson at 23 points. Big possession for High Point. Miles has been the answer. The lob to Hamilton was there. I like that action, though. But Todd wanted to throw in the low post. Nobody was home. Nelson retreats. Outside to Ford for three. Big bucket for the Red Wolves. You mentioned the baseline action. We saw it there for Arkansas State to lead at five. Ford finally in the scoring column. Well, you know why I like that three? Because it came out of the context of the offense. Jippa has remained in the context of the offense for a high point all night. 22 on the board. And a foul called if that's Jippa. With that game, as soon as this one reaches its conclusion. Big moments, five guards basically, high point. That means they'll always have a release because of Nelson. Hamilton picked up by Nelson with a four fouls. Sarkunas for three. And over the back was Hamilton. Clock begins when Fields makes first contact with the basketball. Avery Feltz on the floor. Todd to Nelson, too easy to lead down to four. He got into the paint to Hamilton or Miles. Hamilton with 17, Miles with 16. And it's Duke Miles that corrals it in the backcourt. Ten on the shot clock. Hamilton trying to extend the lead. Got caught and stolen by Lule. Red Wolves can tie it with a three. Shot clock and game clock virtually identical. And Brian Hodson fields to inbound. Todd has it going right to the rim. Spins in the layup, the lead at one. And the foul right away on Duke Miles, an 80% free throw shooter. In possession game. Five for five at the line, now five for six. Point has maintained the slightest of edges. He missed them both. Arkansas State can win it here. And Brian Hodson will call a timeout. Moment of truth has arrived. Todd has it against Hamilton between the legs. 
The spin. Couldn't get the bounce and the rebound. Bodo, Bodo, time expires. I'm sure they'll look at this. And they will. Was waiting for the official word. Hi. Roy, everything I said came into play. Todd was one-on-one. -on -one. Look at Bodo Bodo, though, as the rim protector. Todd had a wide open look, but why fall down there? You had, you were so open. Go ahead and be balanced. Now the question becomes, is there a tie-up with time on the clock? And they're calling game. Ball game is over and high point. Holds on, 81 to 80. So the top seed Panthers out of the Big South will advance to tomorrow's championship, awaiting the winner 